This small place called Aye Plog lies in the heart of Lapland, about 50 kilometers south of the Polar Circle. You can come here and stay in an igloo hotel. Daniel Knapp, one of the people who built it, is sitting right next to me. Daniel, what gave you the idea to build an igloo hotel? Oh, it fits into the landscape. We have lots of snow, cold and white up here, so it's the ideal place. It's a perfect completion of our other attractions. Is it really only made of snow? Yes, our whole construction consists of nothing but snow, except for the doors and the wooden floors inside. That's crazy. How long will the whole thing last? We hope until mid-April, depending on the temperatures. Well, I'm going to spend the night here. I'm excited to find out if it gets cold. Oh, don't worry. You'll get a really great sleeping bag and we have interior temperatures of up to 2 degrees. That shouldn't be a problem. Perfect. So, good night. Thank you. An overnight stay in an igloo raises some questions. Is there a toilet in there? What about doors? Will it be cold? What should I wear? After a short tour, one thing becomes clear. It's cold in here, but it's also incredibly cosy. There are little sleeping igloos. They have a wooden platform with mattresses, reindeer hides and polar sleeping bags. And I found a toilet too. To ensure a perfect evening, you should heed the following igloo hotel survival tips. Don't forget to warm yourself from the inside. You have to dress warmly, but that's not enough. You need inner warmth too. Besides coffee and tea in the snug community igloo, this also means having some alcohol. So just check out the bar at the Igloo Hotel. After a hearty draft of champagne beer, I make a short stop at the grill station, where they serve a special treat, reindeer kebab. Dancing enhances the warming effect and increases the fun. But after a few hours, the cold starts creeping back into your clothing. Then it's time to take the next step. Venture into the outdoors. Here you'll find the obligatory sauna along with hot tubs, which are heated whirlpools. And if you're lucky, you'll even see the northern lights. Unfortunately, I wasn't. The right sleepwear. Every guest gets a polar sleeping bag with a thermal fleece inlet to ensure optimal sleeping comfort the Igloo Hotel staff recommends muffling yourself up in your sleeping bag unclothed or in thermal underwear. That's because polar sleeping bags utilize body warmth. Amazingly, it wasn't cold at all. You can really breathe deeply. The air is fantastic. I must say, I slept really well. Those who can't endure the cold for long can return to the cosy hotel cry at any time. The tiny Swedish village is the best base station for a divine winter holiday. <laughs>